Hi, this is Paul from Wave5Trade.com and this is my daily stock signals video for Tuesday the 19th of June where I pick one of the many signals that we send our members out every day and set it up on a chart and get the entry and everything like that. So very briefly on our stock signals membership area our members get potential long fifth wave trades, short fifth wave trades, stochastic long trades and stochastic short trades on multiple time frames. Today I'm going to concentrate on long trades, potential fifth waves. Uh, these are available on weekly, daily and six minute time frames. Our members simply click on the image here and download the spreadsheet every day, which looks like this for today. And I've looked, chosen the daily time frame. It is also available, signals also available on the weekly and the 60 minute. But today I'm going to concentrate on the daily time frame. And I'm going, I've chosen QEP, QEP Resources Inc. on the daily time frame. So let's set this up for a potential long. So this is the Elliott Wave Indicator Suite from Wave5Trade.com for the Ninja Trader NT8 platform, but it's also available for Thinkorswim, TradeStation, and Multicharts. So very briefly, uh, for those that have got the Elliott Wave Indicator Suite, we just need to isolate at these lows here. This double bottom, re really the second double bottom is the start of this trend as it breaks up. You can see we've got a nice long wave three and a wave four retracement here, which looks very good. So very very quickly let's have a look at the filtration for this data for the signals first of all the wave 4 pullback now this is pulled back into our amber zone so this is one of the filters that we've got a wave 4 pullback and it's behaving reasonably well uh, it's initial found initial support in the amber zone so that's an 80 percent probability it's going to go on and make a new wave 5 high into our automated target zones here around about 1460 Secondly, the 535 oscillator down here, that's pulled back between 90 and 140% and crowned. Just tipped the 140, which is good, still good, and then we've crowned again, so that's good. The stochastics crossed over in the oversold zone now, and then and turning back up again. So those three initial uh, basic filters on the signals, and then we just need to set this up. So let's zoom in, set it up. Stop loss just below the wave four low, around about 1096 stop loss. And then the entry for this, we've got to be above this pivot level here. This was an attempt to, to go long on the fifth wave, but it failed. Okay, it failed to close above the six four moving average high at this point. Now, above this um, resistance level, 1216 is our entry, which is outside of the six four moving average high for today's bar position and above this resistance level. That gives us a risk to reward of one to two into the target zone. So reasonably conservative entry, great risk to reward, and we'd look to go long at 1216. So that's it. That's as simple as it is. We get the signals, we set them up on the indicator suite or on a, on a another chart because we're looking for these entries from this wave four and we we look for the long. So entry 1216 long on the daily time frame for QEP. That's it for today. Have a great training day and I'll speak to you all tomorrow.